Hello everyone, this is Josh, and we're out here today in early April to plant some potatoes. So we've got ourselves some seed potatoes, and although they're called seed potatoes, you can tell that these are definitely not seeds, and they're not seedlings. What they are really is a tuber, and, and really, if we even get more technical, they're kind of a modified stem. As you can see in here, if we take a look, these are the eyes of the potato, and out of the eyes of the potato is where the stem is going to grow. That's important information because it's going to help you orient your potato as you place it into the soil. So if I'm placing this, this specific potato in the soil, I have various options, but most of my eyes are up on top of here. So I'm going to place my potato at the bottom of this trench that we dug, and I'm just going to wiggle it in to bury it down there so all of the eyes are now facing up and the stems that will grow out of those eyes can start to grow towards the sunlight. So we've dug this trench, and this trench is dug about a foot deep. We really dig it about as, as deep as possible and pile up that soil on the sides. That way, as these start to grow, we can start burying those stems. And as we bury those stems, those stems are gonna grow new shoots and new roots that will, that will eventually grow new tubers. And that is how the potato grows. There's a lot of action going on underground. One of the other options I have is to cut the potato in half. And we've cut this potato in half and I have the eye right on top. So I can also orient that and you can make your potato stretch a bit further. We want about a foot spacing between each potato. So I can go all the way down the line orienting my eyes to the sky. After I've done doing that, I can have the students come through. After the students have planted, they can then push that soil over the top. And we want to bury these a couple of inches deep. They're going to be able to push through. And you should start to see them coming up in a couple of weeks. So you're just going to want to water them in really good right after planting. And you'll start to see them, start to see them grow and you can check out our other video of how to bury the stems and when a good time to do that is. Thanks so much for watching.